Today I want to talk to you a little bit more about water purification. You know I've talked on several times about uh, chlorine and iodine, we've talked about boiling, we've talked about a number of different methods of purifying water, but I want to talk to you one that a lot of people don't know about, and it's called using a WAPI, it's a water pasteurization indicator, and a bottle like this. It's very simple to do, especially if you have a solar oven. I'm going to have one of my friends, LaRue Howells, talk about how the WAPI works. She has worked with the Sun Oven for a lot of years, and she understands how this works, and so we're going to let her discuss that. Another valuable tool for a solar oven isn't just cooking, but if you worry about having safe water, you might want to keep this going to be pasteurizing your water while you're doing other things throughout the day. If you have a pot that's dark, this will attract the heat faster and, and bring it to a temperature faster. But you could also use a glass jar. For making it easier for you to see, I'll do the glass jar. Your water pasteurization indicator has some soybean wax in it. And it's hard, and, so it, and then it has a washer on both sides with a fishing wire. So you pull it to have the washer at the bottom, and then you put it in your water. And then this is the fishing line that's on the outside, so that when it's finished, you can just take your washer and your fishing line and pull your WAPI out. It's called WAPI for Water Pasteurization Indicator. And then you just put this in your solar oven. And of course you have a thermostat here, but to be sure that the water's hot enough, the WAPI will tell you. And when it gets to 160 degrees for seven minutes, this soybean oil will be melted and it will go from the top to the bottom of the tube. And then you know your water is safe to drink. Now that isn't sterilized. In order to sterilize water, you need to bring it to 212 degrees. And that you would use if you had cuts or wounds on your body. So for surgical reasons or, or sanitation for sores, you want to boil your water. But for drinking, you can get rid of Giardia and all of the bacteria by bringing it to 160 degrees for the proper amount of time. The thing that's nice about this WAPI is that it's recyclable. Once the, this bottle is hot enough and the water is pasteurized, then you just take the WAPI out and you have safe drinking water. Then the wax will be at the bottom. Then the next time you turn it over this way, pull the washer, and then you can use it again. So you use it over and over. There's one problem with this that I find. It's so tiny, I lost mine within the first three days. So when I finally found it again, I made a little drawstring bag and put it in it, and I thought I'd tie it on the handle of my solar oven. That didn't work, I have grandchildren. So the best place I have found to put it is in my first aid kit. It's wonderful to have, easy to take with you on hikes or anytime you need it, but this will be something that will tell you that your water is safe to drink. And like I said, a glass jar would be fine because it, no matter how hot it gets in there, it's not going to melt. Or you could do it with your, your pot and that will do it warm. There are other ways to sanitize water, pasteurize it, but it's so nice to have it with a solar oven because you can constantly use it over and over.